Look what someone left in our mailbox again. Wait, that's like our fifth one, isn't it? It's getting kind of creepy. Oh, relax. It's probably just from Victor, that flower delivery guy I dated. Who's Victor? We never heard about him. Oh, because I knew you'd never let me go out with an ex-con. Hey, maybe it's Dylan trying to win you back. Mm. So, Victor, it's a closed door? Oh. Maybe it's not a guy who's in love with Haley. Oh, thank you. Maybe it's a guy who's obsessed with Haley and is getting plastic surgery to look like her so he can replace her and live her life. Look. So they can only be for Haley? Of course not. Haley isn't the only hottie living here. Okay. I washed the car in my cheer shorts the other day. I definitely felt eyes on me. Has it ever occurred to you that those flowers could be for me? What do you mean? I mean, like, from my boyfriend. What? You have a boyfriend? And you thought my thing was crazy. <laughs> Alex, you have a boyfriend? You can't just drop that and leave. Honey, it is so exciting. Why didn't you tell us? Because I knew you'd get all weird and ask a million stupid questions. What does he look like? How did you meet him? Okay, I'll show you a photo. Well, I would, but now my phone's not working. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, here he is. In the supermarket flyer? That's him pondering the pork chops? What's the ponder? They're four fifty nine a pound. I don't understand. Why is he in this? He's a model, Mom. Oh, wait, wait. Your boyfriend's a model? Well, how did you meet him? There's not much crossover for a National Honor Society student and a pork model. Well, actually, it's a really long story. I... Oh, well, it's him. Hey, hold on. This is terrific news. I can't believe she didn't tell us about him. Oh, that's what you can't believe? What do you mean? Phil, it is a little weird. I mean, suddenly she has this boyfriend. She wants to show us a picture on her phone, but she can't. And magically, he's in today's paper. <laughs> I don't even want to say it. Haley. She's making it up. Why would she do that? Maybe she's upset that none of us thought those roses could be for her. Oh, and remember when she couldn't get a date for homecoming? She said she didn't care, but mm -hmm. I got her crying in her room. Oh, honey, what'd you say to her? Oh, I, I was super late, so I didn't really... This is sad. Alex has great news and her own mother and sister don't believe her? I want to. Well, I do believe her. I'm gonna tell her to invite this boyfriend over for dinner and I'll be serving a big old platter of I told you so. Oh, great. Maybe you could also serve unicorn burgers and magic beans and I'll invite my boyfriend, Bigfoot. Still better than Dylan. Alec! Hey. His dumb dad got transferred to dumb Africa to operate on some dumb babies. So fixing their hearts is worth breaking mine? It's kind of worth it. He can do like six operations a day. Yeah, I, I, I understand. I'm sorry I'm lashing out. I, I just really liked you. <laughs> I still like you. You're making this worse. Bye, Alec. Bye, Alex. Hey. I knew you couldn't leave without one last kiss. We can work this out. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna regret that, aren't I? Uh, I was hoping you could throw this away from me. Yeah. <laughs>